We are Robin and Kathy, and these are our adventures in our Avan Applause 500 camper van, Serenity. Good afternoon. Back in Serenity after our trip away overseas and we're heading out to a place called Wanji Wanji, not too far from where we live. Um, we'll be spending a couple of nights there. Great bushwalking, it's on, the, uh, on Lake Macquarie, so you've got some nice ocean views. We've been there once before and it really is quite a nice restful place and that's um, pretty much what we're looking forward to doing. A little bit of bushwalking and some sitting around and reading. So I'll get back to you later. We're in Wanji Wanji now, approaching the caravan park. Pulling up at reception and we shall be in position before we know it. Well here we are, settled in at Wanji Wanji. Lovely afternoon. Nice sight and just about 30 metres away is Lake Macquarie. Well we've settled in, we've had a coffee and we're off for our first walk. This is uh, Lake Macquarie, it's quite a big lake. Enters out to the sea at Swansea I think. And They do a lot of water sports on it. They do, yes, a lot of, uh, there's some sailing clubs. There's bushwalks, national park all around it. There's quite a few marinas dotted around and on the weekend you see a lot of sailing going on. They do a lot of sailing competitions here too. Yes. And quite a few nice bushwalks which we'll take on a few today and tomorrow. And as we look back you can see the caravan park. It really is a beautiful location. Two silly girls swimming. Yes. I don't think it's that warm in. One of our traditions when we go away in the camper is wine o'clock and I believe it's wine o'clock right now. What wine is that one Rob? It's a Blackstone Paddock The Player from the Barossa Valley. I'm sure it'll be very nice. Shiraz. It's a Shiraz. Thank 
Hello viewer, well we've just had a lovely dinner, thanks very much Cook, and I'm um, settling in for the evening now, probably a pretty early night, and then up early tomorrow hopefully fly the drone and see what it all, it all looks like from above. So um, we'll catch you tomorrow. Good morning and welcome to uh, our day two, Saturday. Lovely morning, very still. We've been out flying the drone and it was perfect weather for it. And uh, today we're heading off for a bushwalk this morning before lunch and then uh, probably just taking it easy for a while because um, that's what this little trip's all about, just relaxing. breakfast time. We're on a coastal lake walk in heading into Wanji Wanji village. It takes about 40 minutes. We've done it once before and it really is very nice. You hug the side of the lake the whole way so you get some excellent views. And it is a glorious day, very still and the temperature starting to build up already. And you can see the houses just up here in very Australian style they back right onto this reserve which doubles up as their backyard really and gives them the best of everything access to the water room for kids to play Well, we stopped for our morning tea at the local Wanji Wanji RSL club, which is very nice and it's beautifully located. Over here, you've got a lot of kids who are all doing sailing lessons, which really looks like a lot of fun. And we're sitting here. Hello. On our way back, and we must be in the tropics because there's bananas growing. Not something you see every day.
Hi. Well, we've had lunch and a quiet afternoon. Now we're heading off for a sort of mid-afternoon walk. There's a gun emplacement up here somewhere, or the remains of one. And our endeavour this afternoon is to try and find it. Yes, so um, we'll let you know how we go. The path is taking us into the bush. We may never come out. It's quite steep. We have come to a fork in the road. And the navigationalist is assessing the situation. <laughs> we need to go left. And the path stretches out before us. We really don't know how far we've got to go. So we think this is it. Um, reasonably confident because there's a picture and a post up about it. It's interesting because at the moment you can't see much water at all because of the bush but in this picture from the day back in um, 1930s 1940s the area was much clearer and they would have had quite a commanding um, view over the water. There's a small room, may have been used for storage of some kind. Another dark and dingy staircase. And a bigger room. Of course graffiti. Didn't even know any of this was here. So a little further down the path and we've got one of the actual gun emplacements. There were five of them all up, set up with uh, 3.7 inch guns that could double up as um, anti-ship fire if anyone tried to enter Port Macquarie or anti-aircraft fire. So Cathy is pushing the envelope and venturing onto what I think is other people's property through a gate, which is a bit of a giveaway. and. Um, but it is a very nice view at the end of it all. That's the view they would have had with the gun emplacement. Yeah. And who knew when we got back from our walk, it was wine o'clock. Cheers. So what have we got tonight, Cook? Um, tonight is Alfredo sauce with spaghetti and some broccoli. Broccoli there. I'm boiling some water for spaghetti and I've got some sauce that we brought from home. Should be good. Hi, Sunday morning and time for a sit rep. Uh, last night we had dinner and then a quiet evening, watched a bit of YouTube. This morning I was up early flying the drone, taking some still pictures, doing a little bit of soundscape work. And then it's going to be breakfast and heading off home, but we'll be taking our time and stopping off for lunch on the way. Should be good. Well, we're on our way home now. We've had a good trip up to Wanji Wanji. It's a really nice little caravan park um, for bushwalks, for putting a kayak on, out on the lake. Um, just a nice, quiet, little peaceful spot to go for a couple of nights. Here's Rob over here. Just in case you never think he does any of the driving, he does. 
we'll go home now and um, unpack and clean the van up and get on with life. Catch you next time.